Hello guys, welcome back. And uh, let's click on the preview. And now we have seen the hand operation and we're going to look at the OR operation. So I'm gonna take this as it is. Not going to deviate anything from it. <clears throat> Just see what I'm going to do. Okay. And here, all I'm going to do is OR 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 and OR and OR. <clears throat> Let's understand what it means. See, as the name itself says OR, any one of them is true or true. Any one of them is uh, true, right? So if you see a true or true, any one of them is true. Yeah. See here. Now if you say true or false, it has taken the first operation which is true and hence the name true. If it is a false or false, it has taken the false. It is false. False or true. False or true, it has taken one of the operator <coughs> which is true. Which means that, please understand. You have a right oper you have a left operation, you have a right operation, right? You have a left operation, you have a right operation. When you say OR operator, <coughs> it will check whether this is true. If this is true, then it will take this value. In case if this is false, then it will check if this is true. If this is true, then it will take this value. Say, let's take the 1 plus 1 example. See, 1 plus 1 equal to 2, which is, okay, let's take this example, okay, and try to understand. Okay, 1 plus 1 equal to 2, which is true, okay, which is true, or 10 plus 10 equal to 50 is false. So what has happened? This is true, so it takes this value and hence the value true. Now for some reason, assume that I will make it as 1 plus 1 is equal to 2, 1 plus 1 is equal to 3 and 10 plus 10 is equal to 20. So what has happened? <coughs> it has taken as false or true, correct? So I am going to change this. What will ideally happen? This is false. This will ignore. This is true and this will take it. Yeah, this will take it as simple as that. See here, if I'm going to change this. See here. See? Still true. See? Now here as well. This is true and this is false. So it has taken the false state, true statement. Now assume that 1 plus 1 is equal to 3 is false and 10 plus 10, which is, say so if I say 50, both of them are false. Since this is false and this is false, the condition will be false. So that is an OR operator. OR means one of them should be true. AND means both of them should be true. So let's say, let's make it up. OR means one of them should be true AND means both of them should be true. Clear? Very good. Now, <coughs> Now with that in mind, let's go to the next one, not operator. Um, where it is, okay, let's go to the not operator. And here, <coughs> I'll say K1. Um, in the K1, I'm going to say, see, not of true. See, it is false, which means that, guys, it is like, if you are a, if you are a good person, say if you are a good person, I know it's, if you are a good person and if you say not, if you add a not, which means you are not a good person, which means you are a bad person. That is what it does. If you say bad person and if you say not of bad person, which means you are a good person, right? In a similar way, if you say true. If you say true and if you say not of true, what happens? It is false. 
and that is exactly what has happened not of true is false now if i say not of false it should be true see i'll say um not of false see it is true okay <clears throat> now let's take this example and see what happens okay um uh no this doesn't work out like that okay if i say not okay okay see here now what i have I done i have taken this example and i just pasted here nothing else okay both of them are said what is the output of this the output of this is true oh, so the output of this is false okay the output of this is false all i have done is added a not here and i have added this bracket and i have just added this bracket so what is not of false not of false is true see not of false is true that's it it's as simple as that not means anything which is just like you are negating that okay so now if you see here now let's take this example what is the output of this the output of this is true now if i add a not operator this should become false here okay i am going to do that just check it out i'm going to take as it is okay paste it over here all i'm going to do is see not always remember that you need to have a space if you don't have a space it will not evaluate you need to have a space see see this k5 k6 false and true no see true and false okay guys cool clear on this very clear on this okay good now <clears throat> finally the not operator this is one and the same there is no difference i'm going to change it to k3 k4 and i'm going to change i'm going as i said before there is no difference for it it's just one and the same i want to show this now not of two see not of true is false not of false is true see this it's getting changed see and here as well if i just say not it is true okay <clears throat> not sorry not is yes, the it's one and the same it's one and the same but as i said the precedence matters precedence matters and that's where i'm going to talk about combination of both of them uh, to do that i have to take another one i am going to say this comma comma um combine not exclamation okay combine not exclamation okay and see what happens as usual i am going to uh, just double click on this so that becomes bigger okay <clears throat> now i am going to say k1 okay in this sir now if i say not of true or true okay see it has become false it has become false see let's go by our or expression see what what is or any one of them is true do you agree any one of them is true see it will evaluate this guy it is true and then it will apply not and hence it's false do you okay now see the same thing i'm going to do here say k2 what i'm going to do is that i'm going to say not true or t r u e or true guys see the difference even though both of them are same see here here you got the false and true why why is this i'll tell you the reason behind it that let's go back to our notepad this guy not 
true of if you write something like this it will actually evaluate like this okay it just means that this guy will be evaluated first okay this guy will be evaluated one and then this guy will be evaluated so true or true what is true or true which is true then you are applying not of true that becomes false and in this guy the second option see here not true or true this becomes false it this gets evaluated first false then this is true false or true it becomes true now if i just change a little bit here see here if i change something like this i just say k3 see true or true see false because not of true is false not of true is false false and false or false is false now finally k5 is here what if i do like this not of true or true is here now this guy is same as this guy okay this guy is same as this guy okay so lot of and or no rod oh my gosh this is too much to take in so it's a good session though uh, anyways i'm going to export this and give it to you guys make sure that uh, you guys import it and work it out i'm not going to delete any of those operations i'll give it to you as it is so that's it for this video and we are in the next video we are going to look at some more exciting stuff it's on its way couldn't wait for long okay All right guys see you guys in the next data view section until then take care and have a great learning